Welcome back guys to Red Dead Redemption 2. I hope you're having fun. If so, smash those like and subscribe buttons and now let's go. All right, this is it. Red Dead Redemption. If the name of the mission doesn't tip you off yet, this is probably gonna be the final one. Well, at least uh, unless there's an epilogue or something. Things are definitely coming to a head right now. We've lost almost everybody that's important. Abigail. A safe check. We hid, but they took Abigail. Who did? Agent Milton and his men took it to Van Horn to be put on a boat and tried for murder. I am sorry to hear that. We gotta let her go. John's, uh, well, sorry, son. Without John, she's just bait. We got a bunch of money, Dutch. She's just a girl. They won't do nothing to her, but me and the boys know. Yep. We need to keep riding on this one, Dutch. You know it. Every man here knows so we it. we just gonna let the boy be made an orphan? It, it ain't like that. What is it like? I wanna live, cowpoke. I still got the choice, Dutch. It's just a girl. You're right. Dutch, Micah. Uh, it pains me to say it, Arthur. But he is right. Dutch! Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. He is become fully O'Driscoll right now. Okay. I guess that's that then. All them goddamn years. Come on, Arthur. Let's go get her. You and me is all we need. Yes, that's a good crew. I trust Sadie. Here. Take this. You take this money, too. Take Jack. And you wait a copper head landing for Abigail and Mrs. Adler. Thank you, Arthur. You're a good girl. You live a good life now, you hear? All right, Arthur. I'll... I'll miss... Me too, sweetheart. Me too. Jack, come here. Be brave, son. I'm gonna go get your mama. Mrs. Adler! Ride with me! Oh, well, they are both determined. I love it. If they're putting her on a boat, they'll probably dock at the north end of town. So I reckon we should go in the other way. Sure, I guess. I don't know. God, those goddamn bastards. Look, just follow me, okay? We're gonna get this done, Arthur. Well, I have to say I'm happy that I have Sadie with me for the last mission. Her or Charles would have been my preferences. Well, don't care if he orphans his friend's child so long as he gets rich. All this goddamn talk all them years. Seems like it was always a lie. Or he went crazy. What a mess. Sure. Guess he began to believe he was God or something. I don't know. I'm sorry you got dragged into this. Into us. Listen, if you hadn't shown up in my house that night, I'd be dead. And even this bullshit beats dead. I thought I could find a way to get John, Abigail, and Jack out of this mess. Give them a life. Seems I left it too late. If we could still get Abigail, maybe her and Jack will be okay. John, Hosea, Mac, Davy, Jenny, Sean, Lenny. Oh, Jesus, <laughs> what the heck was that? Man, I was an autopilot. How could you even hit that tree, man? <laughs> Ridiculous. <laughs> let's let's cure ourselves. Jesus. Mac, Davy, Jenny, Sean, Lenny. We have to put an end to this. <coughs> an eagle flies. Another angry fool he used just like he did with the rest of us. Like I said, Arthur, we don't need them. We're gonna make this right. Me and you together. What's left of it. Now come on. Alright then, Mrs. Adler, lead the way. Man, this is the final mission and Arthur is still going strong despite his illness. I wonder what kind of climax that will be. Let's ditch the horses and come up with a plan. Easy! 
I mean, I thought his illness would play a bigger role than this. How you feeling? I'm okay. I think you should cover me and I'll go in there and get her. Because you're the better shot, I mean. That ain't what you mean. I can still fight. I know, Arthur. But just do it my way, honey. It's for the best. Get up someplace high, like the lighthouse or something. And cover me. Please. Okay. Well, she is kind of right, man. You are too sick for this. And actually, I do enjoy sniping. That's my kind of thing in games. I always fancied myself a sniper. <laughs> Not a very good one, mind you. But still. Although there was a game that I was pretty good at. I don't know if uh, anybody was around when uh, Day of Defeat was a thing. It was a uh, Counter-Strike clone, so to speak. From Valve, the same company that made Counter-Strike. Man, I loved sniping in that game. Alright, but I, I digress. Let's get back to this. So we seem to be covering Sadie from up high. Okay, Mr. Milton. Where are you? Oh man, wouldn't it be awesome if I got to execute him? Oh, is that Abigail? Alright, I'm gonna look where she looks to know where the enemies are. Should I take them out? Well, <laughs> I guess I should before asking questions. It is a bit tough when they move around. I don't know if uh, there's any bullet travel time, you know, time before the bullet hits its target, so... That would make it a hell of tougher. I think it's instant. And I have to say, although it is realistic to have some bullets travel time, I don't really like it in games, in action games that is. If it's a sniper game, I'm fine with it. But here, I uh, much rather like keeping it simple. Like if he's on your crosser, he dies. Oh man, the music is getting dramatic. What's gonna happen? I can't imagine they will kill Abigail. I mean, no game. No game leaves a boy orphan. Come on. I can't even believe John died. Jesus. Yeah, no way Abigail is dying. Alright, let's see what happens. I'm not so sure about Sadie though. Oh yeah. They got her. Okay, Mr. Milton. I guess we're gonna have to talk this out like gentlemen. Oh boy, which means anything unlike gentlemen. <laughs> Man, he is laboring hard, Arthur is. I wonder what will happen because remember, they have uh, Abigail and Sadie in there. I mean, we can't really go in guns blazing now, can we? That will uh, that will be almost a death sentence for them. I imagine Milton will have them at gunpoint when we enter or something. Interesting to see how we get out of that situation. <laughs> Although I imagine Sa Sadie will still have uh, some tricks up her sleeve. Who knows, maybe even Abigail. I mean, she is, Abigail is a very interesting uh, human specimen. She's like a regular woman, no fight in her, you would think. And then there are some moments where she just uh, explodes. And you'd think that she could uh, take on the role of Sadie at some point, but she's more... Jeez, come on, dude, <laughs> get out of my face. She's more of a lady than is Sadie. So I guess we got Sadie and a lady. Not many enemies yet. That's interesting. 
kind of expected more for a final mission, but yeah, I bet we have to also escape if we manage to save Sadie and uh, Abigail, so maybe on the way back. All right. Yeah, as I said, pretty quiet. Not many enemies. Yeah, there are a few of them riding in with horses, but these enemies are where to sparing. I mean... Something doesn't feel right. Alright, I have a new theory. We go in and we do not find them. They are already gone. They are on a boat or something. Because this opposition... I don't know. I'd expect much more from the game. I expect a whole army for a final mission. Damn, I expect the two armies, even. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> oh. I feel so bad when I shoot them in the head and I only... Nice. And I only get uh, to shoot the hat off their head. <laughs> it's like the game telling me, yeah, <laughs> try again. Oh, ouch. Okay, let's, let's use some dead eye. Okay, that I moment again. Oh, jeez, where did you come from? <laughs> and I got his hat off. Oh, wow. Slab fight. <laughs> oh, I love how he kicks him for good measure afterwards. Like he's angry. All right, here we go. The final stretch, let's see. Let's make sure nobody shoots at us. Okay. Wow, too easy. Okay, ladies, let's get out of here. Calm down, Mr. Morgan. Of course. <laughs> That's quite a cough. Sure. Tuberculosis. I'll be dead soon. And you with me, Mr. Milton? You'll be dead, sure. But I'm gonna be just fine. We offered you a deal, Mr. Morgan. You should have taken it. I'm a fool, Mr. Milton. Not all you boys have quite so many scruples. Old Micah Bell? Micah? You mean Molly? Molly O'Shea? Sweated her a couple of times, never talked a word, had to let her go. Micah Bell. We picked him up when you boys came back from the Caribbean. And he's been a good boy ever since. Oh, man. Figures. Okay. <laughs> oh, geez, we are losing that. Mr. Morgan? Oh, is that the way we go? Come on, no, not this way. Oh, thanks. Jesus. Oh, I told you Abigail had some fight in her. Nice one. Horrible man. <laughs> now come on, both of you. We will tell her about John. Maybe that's not the correct time now. Of course, now we need to escape. No, she asked about Jack, but not about John. Interesting. Abigail, you ride mine. What are you doing? Get on, Arthur. Arthur. Get on. You'll be okay. All right. So what's the plan now, I wonder? Okay, it's not over. <laughs> we can think about what's next in a little bit. First, we need to take care of these guys. Ooh, what a mean look. <laughs> I love that mugshot of Arthur. Oh, 
man, I really need dead eye when I'm on when I'm fighting on horses. I think that's what dead eye was made for. It's really, really tough. Wow, <laughs> again. What a mean face. Love it. I could shoot at them with the uh, rifle. But I don't know, man. There's just something cool about the revolvers. You can't say this about all handguns. Usually I find handguns boring in games. But the revolvers, man. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good. Or desert eagles. Those things pack a punch. I love this kind of impactful small weapons. In games, I mean, of course. Gotta talk about John at some point, right? No time. Time. What happened to John? Exactly. Where's John? I, I don't know. I think. Arthur. He. What? He got killed or he got captured. No. I'm really sorry. No! Abigail, I'm, I was on the train and I didn't see it. No! Listen. No. We got Jack. He's safe. Mrs. Adler will take you to him. But, John, I want you to know this. He loved you. He loved you and Jack, he did. He wasn't perfect, but he did. No. You gotta go get that boy. Come on, get out of here. Arthur, what are you doing? I gotta go have a little chat before I get much sicker. No, Arthur. Don't you owe Arthur me. Neither of you two. Not now. You both know. You're good women. Good people. The best. You go get that boy. There'll be time for sorrow later. If you're headed back there, Arthur, take this. I don't need it anymore. What's that? There's a chest in them caves, in the back to the left, hidden under a wagon. Duchess chest. Oh, uh -huh, interesting. I, I know John told you I knew where it was. <sighs> Abigail Roberts. Always was a good thief. That she was. <laughs> Go on, get out of here. <sighs> oh man, that's a sad ending. I know we get the money, but kind of feels pointless right now, doesn't it? I mean, everybody important except for uh, Abigail and Jack are dead. Oh man, what a mess. And how about Arthur? I can't believe he will survive this. He's too sick, he's been saying it, he's dying and when somebody's dying in a game, they tend to go out very, very heroically. I guess we'll just find out shortly. There's a good man within you. How Arthur goes. But he is wrestling with a giant. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. Alright, that about does it. It's pretty much bad. If we hear the words of the doctor, that means we are gone pretty soon Good that's when the doctor gave us uh, the diagnosis about tuberculosis mind you and the music oh that's another indication everything is coming to an end 
So we're now going back to get the money. What are we gonna do even with it? Who are going are we going to give it to? Because we are not keeping it. And I'll be damned if Dutch take it. That would be a very sad ending. You're a good man. life is literally flashing before his eyes right now. He's reminiscing on everything. This is gonna be such a dramatic end, I can feel it. Alright, I think we're here. Now let's see what happens. So curious. Oh, well, somebody's there. Who's that? Dim bags packed up quick, Miss Grimshaw. Come on, all of you. Well, we're doing our best. Hurry, we ain't got long. Hurry. We just got plenty of time, Micah. Oh. We all need to have a little chat. Black Long, you're back. Hooray. <coughs> I just saw Agent Milton, Dutch. Abigail shot him. She's okay. Not that you care too much about that, you rats. All of you. Seems old Mark it was pretty close with Milton. What the hell are you talking about, cowpoke? You talked. That's a goddamn lie. Dutch. Dutch. Think of the future. Milton told me. <laughs> and you believe him, Black Lung? You believe him? It all makes sense now. No. It damn well doesn't. Dutch, think. Dutch, be practical now. Oh boy. Dutch! Oh wow. John's alive. You left me. You left me to die. My boy. I didn't have a choice. John, I didn't. You! I didn't have a choice. You left me! All of you, you pick your side now because this is over. All oh, them years, Dutch, for this snake. <laughs> oh, be quiet, cowpoke. Be quiet. You live in the clouds. No, you be quiet, Mr. Bell, and put down your gun. There's Pinkerton's coming fast. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Now! <laughs> Who amongst you is with me? And who is betraying me? Well, I'll be in. Think. Think for yourself. He's lying. He's lying. Put your guns down! God damn it! See, if I'm lying, how did they find us? Yeah. Everyone get down! This is Agent Ross with the Pinkerton Detective Agency. Put your guns down! We don't know what's going on! Watch for Ross! Oh, wow, so. What is the fight now? It's me and John, the Pinkertons, and Dutch and the guys? Oh, man. Three sides fighting. Oh no, he's leaving, okay. <laughs> yeah, the others, uh, the cowards left. Man, I knew it about Micah. I mean, the way he was uh, trusting Dutch's every decision certainly looked like he was leading him on. I mean, Micah is smart. He's not a... Uh, he wouldn't follow Dutch's crazy plan. He just wanted to turn him in eventually, I guess. And I think he will succeed then. 
but since uh, Dutch seems to still be trusting him, man, what a mess. Is Dutch gonna get caught or die? Seems that's what they do now. To be honest with you, I kind of don't want him to die. Like, imagine if we would get a uh, third Red Red Redemption. And imagine as we could play that we could play as Dutch maybe in a third Red Dead Redemption. Man, that would be awesome. I mean, I can't see Arthur surviving. Maybe John, but we've played as John, so there's no point in that. I'd love to play as Dutch, man. Abigail. Abigail's safe. So's Jack. Where are they? It was Sadie. The Copperhead landed. Thank you, brother. I want you to not look back. Like I said. <laughs> Alright, are we going with him? Hopefully. Oh, Jesus! They are chasing us down. And is Dutch with them? Is Dutch firing at us? Arthur, gotta go. Come on, ride. Or is it just Micah? Because Micah obviously wants me dead. In the trees ahead. Look out. But uh, Dutch was still undecided during that uh, <laughs> Mexican standoff there. It's gonna be interesting now that we've uh, put the seed of doubt about Micah in Dutch's mind. How will things say, shake down finally? I mean, Micah needs to die in this game. I mean, that would be just poetic justice. Probably we will kill him during this mission, I expect. Or maybe he kills us even. Wow, man, that would be sad. Come on, Arthur. I gotta move. Oh, ouch. Uh, uh, yeah, what now? Yep. Man, we are too exposed here, no cover. Wow, I had her the entire game, man. Come on. Let's go. Give me a second. Come on. Push, Arthur. Thank you. Arthur. Come on, Arthur. Yeah. Let's go. Well, what about the money? Abigail gave me the key. I head down there, I'm dead in five minutes. I got a family. That's more important. Ah, uh, maybe you're right, but... Uh, you want the money? You head down. I gotta go to my family. Oh, we got a choice. No, I'm helping John. Screw the money. Who cares about it now? I'm dying anyway. I'm coming with you. I'm gonna get you out of this bullshit. If it's the last goddamn thing I do. Thank you. Oh shit! Let's go! We need to find higher ground! Don't worry about them! They'll just be going back for the money! We need to get the hell out of here! Man, I really wonder what happens if I didn't help John? Would he have died? That would be sad, man. <laughs> I probably would have restarted and replayed the entire game just to save John. I could not have lived with that decision. Shit. <sighs> well, let's get up this cliff. Here you go. Come on, Arthur. Why are we going up, though? I mean, we will be trapped if we go up. Okay, I guess John has a plan. Let's hope it's a good one. <laughs> That's his plan, probably. Get behind the rock. <laughs> That's the entirety of his plan. Wow, man. Bullets flying. Come on. Oh, man. Dead eye is not working. 
I could not target this guy behind the rock. We need to get out of here. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Okay, cuts in. Is this where it ends? All right, Arthur, come on, let's go. You go. Keep pushing, Arthur. No. <coughs> no. I think I've pushed all I can. Come on. You go. We ain't got time for this. Not now. We ain't both gonna make it. Go. Now. I'll hold them off. It would mean a lot to me. Please. There ain't no more time for talk. Go. Arthur. Go to your family. Arthur! Get the hell out of here and be a goddamn man. You're my brother. I know. I know. Wow, this is about to be our last battle, I can feel it. He's even trembling, cannot even stand. Come on, man, take cover. Okay. Although it doesn't seem like too much of a... Oh, oh wow, they are swarming me. Okay, as long as I got dead, I, I will stay alive. They will probably overwhelm me though soon. Oh man. Okay. Please kill this guy. Oh Jesus. Maybe we are both gonna die. Come on, get up. Kill this guy. Oh, Black Hawk. You don't know how much I long to do this. I can't really hit him. Can only try to break free here. Okay, there you go. Alright, let's be methodical about this. Only counter-attacks. Man, will I take Micah out? Oh, he's good. He's good. He's avoiding most of my punches. This could be scripted. Although I'm getting a few pretty good hits on him. Okay, this is out of my control. Come on, man. <laughs> Jesus, he's got a counter-attack for everything. Okay, cutscene. Still got a little fight in you, have you, boy? Oh, come on, we cannot die from Micah. I will hate this game if we do. At least let Dutch kill us or something, not Micah. Or even better if we can kill this guy. Come on. I mean, if we kill Micah, I think Arthur would die in peace from his uh, illness or something. Jesus, this fight is dragging out. Come on. I mean, we are hitting him pretty good now. Come on. Go down, man. Jesus. This is relentless. This guy has the energy of a gorilla. Oh, okay. Screen went red there. Couldn't do anything about this. Can only block. And he's not blocking even though I'm pressing it. Come on. Oh, Jesus. He's gonna kill us? Thank God. All there is. Winning and losing. 
All right, who's gonna get the gun then? Come on, man, get up. Please don't die for Micah. You ain't gonna reach that gun. You ain't. I'm closer than you, man. You lost my sick friend. Come on, man. You lost. Jesus, I'm pressing L so hard. Stop talking and reach the gun. Is Micah toying with me? Or is he going for that gun as well? Oh, come on, we have it. Oh, no. It is over now, Arthur. It's over. Oh, Dutch. He's right. You know it. I know it. He's sick. He's dying. He's talking crazy. Yeah, up there on the ridge. I gave you all I had. I did. Uh, Come on, Dutch. Let's go, buddy. We made it. Uh, we won. Come on. John made it. He's the only one. <laughs> the rest of us. No. But, I tried. In the end, I did. Come on. Let's go. We can make it. Come on, Dutch. Come on! Ah! So everybody goes their separate ways then. I guess it's only fitting. Now I don't expect Arthur to make it. Let's see though. Will we? Will he get up one last time? Yeah, judging from the music. Probably not. Well, I guess that was the story of Arthur Morgan then. At least he went out fighting and he saved John and Abigail. That's actually a good message from the game to send. He saved the family. That's uh, that's an admirable cause. Yeah, it's morning and he's still there. That's definitely the end for Mr. Morgan's adventures.